Member for Surrey Guilford. Thank you, Honourable Speaker. Ramadan is the most sacred month of the year for Muslims. The Prophet Muhammad reportedly said, when the month of Ramadan starts, the gates of heaven are opened and the gates of hell are closed and the devils are chained. Muslims believe it was during this month that God revealed the first verses of the Quran, Islam's sacred text to Muhammad on the night that became known as the night of power. I'm honored to join with our Muslim friends in the holy month of Ramadan. I join with you and send my best wishes to Muslims across the country and throughout the world. Muslims see a reflection and renewal in their lives, a time to transform their very lives by restoring justice and equity. We must reflect together on the pain and suffering that we all see around us. Terrible anguish has been inflicted on the Palestinian people because of the war in Gaza. 30,000 Palestinians, mostly civilians, including children, have been killed. Nearly 2 million Palestinians have been uprooted because of the war in Gaza, and all of them are in dire need of food, water, medicine, and shelter. As we observe Ramadan, I ask that you keep these victims in your thoughts and minds. In British Columbia and Canada, we must be mindful of the recurrence of hatred in our midst as a result of Islamophobia and acts of outright violence and hate toward Muslims. There's no place here for such despicable behavior. No one in this nation should fear persecution for the religious faith or practice where they go to school, to work, or in the streets. Muslims here should know that they are deeply valued in the wonderful mosaic that comprises Canada. Muslims here in British Columbia thrive in all parts of our society, striving for excellence in business, academia, government and education, healthcare, social sciences, human rights, and the arts. To all of those uh, who celebrate, I wish a healthy, safe, and blessed Ramadan. Ramadan Mubarak.